is going on everybody welcome back to the channel if you're new here i go by empress gem i drop the jewels taurus placements you are up this is your general energy read for the rest of april 2021 general message guys take what's free leave the rest behind any events to show your girl that love and support like comment share and subscribe to the channel hit the web <clears throat> excuse me yeah because this message is deep hit the website up book a reading all right all that good jazz but um yeah how i just closed up <laughs> about to tell you to hit the website or go check something out go go do something um i feel i was hearing remember that thing i did <laughs> or remember remember that time like it's something i'm feeling that you know happened in the past that you guys felt like wouldn't come back around or you know you didn't have to worry about it, it was probably swept under the rug or something of that nature. Something's bringing its way back around for some of you guys. Because we got paid the piper and move on. So that is karma coming. It could be good karma. Could be bad karma. I don't know your life. But with this temperance card. Divine timing is here. It's time to balance out a situation. Some of you guys will end up becoming renewed and rebirthed throughout this. Because I also seen the ascension card. So it could be good karma for some of you guys. Okay. But with this narrow path. Tread thoughtfully. I feel like some of you guys could have did something here, could have caused some illusion or something or tried to hide something or whatever. And I feel like it's coming out for some of you guys, okay? And just deal with it and move forward. But again, be cautious how you're moving forward. I also picked up the energy because your birthday season is right around the corner. You guys got a lot of people who are watching to see what you're going to do when it, like on your birthday or whatever. Like, show out. Show out on them because they want to see, like, show out okay show out for them all right like that's what i'm feeling like i feel like you didn't do nothing you know 2020 because covid just struck and it's like everything you say for last year put that on top of this year and just show out like for real because you got people who are wondering like how you do it or how you're doing it or whatever um yeah this is we're gonna see how this comes out but there's quite a bit of energy that is moving around with you guys here yeah and again that's ascending the mountain moving forward like i said some of you guys going through this ascension here be very cautious of the people around you okay yeah because like i said there are people who are watching you who are paying attention who are waiting to see either how karma is going to play like i said there's some of you guys who's on good karma and some of you guys who are on bad karma and some people want to see you fall and want to see it happen but i'm also feeling like there are people who are wishing for this fall okay hoping that your birthday or something fails something fails for you but i just feel like this renewness come <clears throat> this renewing coming regardless yeah somebody doesn't want to see you elevate and grow good or bad i just feel like at the end of the day, you know, if you are very cautious, pay attention to the signs, you should be straight. All right. So Divine Holy Spirit, give me the message here. What do we have for our Taurus placements? Please and thank you. One card for our Taurus placement. Placements. Yeah, that was like so angrily thrown out. Like, ugh. Solitude and silence priest prevails. Yeah, like don't even say anything. Don't address stuff. I mean, unless you really have to. And again, still be cautious of what it is that you say don't especially if you're like on the bad side don't get yourself caught up in any more drama just tell the truth and move the hell on pay the piper and move the hell on but um for a lot of you guys like i said you have people who are watching you okay and people who are trying to provoke you don't respond don't react do your shit and keep shining okay yeah first light your ass is shining okay i'm feeling a leo energy watching your ass okay sun energy um, but you're beginning a new cycle, okay? It's your birthday coming up, your birth season, all right? Your solar return, all that good jazz, however you want to frame it. <clears throat> and somebody just does not want to see you shine. Like, somebody doesn't even want to hear you speak. Like, I feel like when you speak, you disturb this person. When you post, you disturb this person. When you move, you do when you breathe, you disturb this person, like... Whatever this energy is, you disrupt it by living your life here. And spirit is just saying, move past that shit, okay? Like, just move past that shit. Ooh, yes. With this ace of fire here, this ace of wands, you got better things to do. Move past that. Let it go with that four of swords. Call it a truce, okay? These people are sitting around like sitting ducks, not doing anything, okay? Nothing better than you. So let's get it, spirit.
what I say? A new era, new contracts, new everything, new life, new cycles, okay? You got the title card, new contracts, all right? Some of you guys are moving, getting new cars, all right? Abundance is pouring into you, okay? You've put in the work. You work hard. You started grounding and stabilizing yourself. You did the saving, okay? You knew what was coming up, all right? And you just got people who are just literally sitting around like fucking ducks. Like, I'm seeing the little, like, the duck. Like, they're not, a, they can't even get in your water. Like, they're just sitting there looking thirsty, dry as hell. Yeah, like I said, you took your time here, Taurus, in your energy. Took your time with that Knight of Wands energy or whatever, the Son of Earth, okay? Really patiently, you know, mapped everything out, scoped everything out. Like I said, you guys are saving. You were stacking your money up, doing things behind the scene. Okay, getting ready because, you know, you're getting ready for a new year of life within yourself. If you're anything like me, people be like, oh, January 1st. But I always say my birthday, you know, is my new year. Okay, that's when I have another chance, you know, to start life and do it right again in another year for me and my life. Okay, unless your birthday is January 1st. Okay. Yeah, see what's coming in is a change of luck. This is why this is happening, okay? Um, yeah. That's beautiful. Why, why, why? Could be saying 333, three, three. okay? We'll start there. 444. But, um, yeah, you've been working and holding back and investing in yourself, doing what you're supposed to do, okay? And that's why this is coming around. Spirit is saying that you really need to walk away from people, places, and things that are no longer serving you, especially emotionally. Like, if these people aren't bringing happiness and joy to you or, you know, not rooting for you and cheering you on, you know, as you're focusing on this new... Oh, noticing that. As you're focusing on this newness that you're... um going towards look at this you have this energy around you new energy new contracts new everything and moving forward in the future this is what you're still you're still moving towards it okay you're still going to be great regardless and that's abundance period and you've taken the time to really uh, manifest this thing and and work on it okay work on this these new contracts this new car you know i'm seeing a home for somebody okay like somebody is just like this house even got a nice deck with a pool all right but spirit is saying like it's time for you to move on and just you know let it go i feel that you have a lot of these people have broken your heart have let you down um have told you that you wouldn't be anything okay have come and tried to strip you emotionally you know of your nurturing nature and it's like now you're on to something new. You're releasing these people as you go into a new year of your life here, okay? Moving into great abundance, all right? You've been putting in a lot of work towards in your energy, just working hard, working, working, working. And at the end of the day, you're bossing up, okay? Could be dealing with an Aries, all right? Could be a Taurus Aries cusper, saying it exactly that way. All right. So but you're bossing up, you're doing what you gotta do. Um, you're opening that business, you're standing in your power, okay, with the stability here, you're holding back and you're not giving to people and that's okay because you're investing in yourself and you realize that is what is time to do here. So when it comes to paying this piper and move on, I feel like in the past, you you did, okay? You confessed whatever you had to confess, you released what you had to release, whatever, you paid the piper and because you're moving forward now, this the universe is blessing you with this abundance here and this ability to even have for some of you guys in love, you know, your divine counterpart, you know, your husband, your wife, somebody who is going to also support you and be in control here. A lot of you guys, I'm also seeing a new job coming in. If you filled out an application here and you've been waiting, I'm feeling that spirit is saying all your hard work that you have put in, this job is coming, okay? And it's going to be very lucrative here for you, very, very much so, okay? Some of you guys, you are even getting that six-figure job that you've been hoping and waiting for. This is your time to shine. All right. So whatever major and big that it is that you're planning here and that you're going for, understand that it's your time to have it. OK, just continue to put in the work. All right. If you guys are Taurus Aries cuspers. Go watch that reading because when I'm looking at these bees here, you're putting in this work. You also could have an Aries that could be trying to get you caught up in their web. Um, could be a Leo as well because that was heavy energy in their reading. Uh, you have fixed energy out here, yeah, with the Wheel of Fortune, Leo, okay? But um, could be a Scorpio, Aquarius, or even you, Taurus. This is still you changing and making this happen here for you, okay? 
But definitely go check out that Aries reading because it, it was a thing about somebody, something coming in and trying to entrap you as well, especially if you are a Taurus Aries cusper, okay? Someone could be trying to trap you as well and block you from moving forward here. But I feel like you know already because, again, you've taken the time to plan these things out. This Pisces energy here, spirit is letting you know, is letting me know that you ideally already know from the people who, how they hurt you that you need to move away and walk away from a lot of you guys, especially if you have Pisces heavily, high, highly aspected in your chart. Yes. So, yeah, but either way, you guys are onto something new and beautiful because you have put in the work. All right. So don't worry about them, folks. I feel like a lot of you guys already know this. Drunkos, anyway, who are sitting around watching you getting drunk. Oh my God, Taurus is moving on and doing so great. Whatever. But um, you guys have the wine is helping, okay? You're fresh out of fucks and you're embracing your inner peace, which is beautiful. So some of you guys also, you know, you're just laid up, chilling, relaxing. Enjoy that happy hour. Enjoy this abundance here, okay? Get ready to go out and celebrate, all right, with your homies. Chop wood, carry vodka, like I said. Get to work. After work, you deserve that drink. Because, again, you guys have paid the piper and you've moved on, all right? And you're just working on you. Also could be dealing with a Virgo there with that solitude energy. But, um, yes, Taurus, I like it. That has been your energy read for the rest of April. Uh, if you want to book a read and all that, sister below, you know I'm here for it, guys. Until the next time we speak, peace out.